And then that transition right afterwards. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um, Katrina Velarde, you just rocked my world. Hey, what's up? Aaron here for reaction number 77. I'm back with Katrina Velarde. This is Latin medley, which many of you have suggested this several times. Super excited for this. Um, I think that, uh, yeah, it'll be interesting. It does show uh, what songs are covered here, assuming it's complete. So, um, it, you know, it shows Spain, Oye Como Va, all this love and don't you worry about a thing. Now, in full disclosure, um, I don't know all this love. And I think they're talking about the Chicory version of Spain. I'm not sure, which I haven't heard in quite some time, actually. Um, so, yeah, let's just get to it. Looking forward to it. Love her hair here. Yesterday, just a photograph of yesterday, and all its edges folded in the corners, faded sepia brown, and yet it's all I have of a past love. script to its ending so a couple things I mentioned her hair I, it reminds me of Tina Turner um, and I don't think um, yeah I mean maybe this is all this love but I think this is this is uh, Spain because the instrumentation sounds very chicory ish I don't really remember the song. It's been too long, I think, since I've heard that. But I don't think that it had lyrics. Um, and she just sounds so raw and beautiful here. Um, her vibratos, her onsets, her lower register. Wow, I don't think I've heard her go this low. I mean, she is really down there here. It sounds so full and, and beautiful in that low register. Corners faded sepia brown. And yet, it's all I have of a past love. A postscript to its ending. Beautiful. It's like we're right almost there. Sorry. Um, that tattoo was like almost, I'm trying to figure out what that was. It was like almost an infinity symbol, but it clearly isn't. What is that? Um, maybe those are birds and it's like almost an infinity opened up. Um, I don't know if there's some specific significance to that. Uh, I, maybe it's some, uh, letter Greek or uh, otherwise, I, I don't know what that is. Um, to me, it looks like infinity that's kind of opened up and the birds are flying away going into infinity or something. So that's the way I'm interpreting it. But anyway. Bright days, I can see. Such brighter days when every song we sang is sung again. Now Sorry, I got an ad, so I'm gonna use this opportunity since it stopped to um, go ahead and just comment. I love her tone on the brighter days. Um, just fantastic. Brighter days. Beautiful. I can see such brighter days. When every song we sang is sung again And now we know, we know this time it's for good And we're lovers once again Ooh. Kind of a little evil eye And you're, you're near That was very jazzy. Near me. You're near me. Yeah, very jazzy. I can remember the rain in the sand, but the leaves Woo! are brown on the ground. In 
That was incredible. First of all, I was shocked because I literally thought it was just her singing. And then the band comes in and I didn't have any clue. And oh my gosh, those runs are so technically difficult. And the timing, this band and her too, is just so tight. So tight. Like, boom. I mean, impressive. These, these runs... Um, melodically are very challenging and she's she's also grew oh this was fantastic so far to date absolutely best i've heard her period hands down right here um this is unbelievable this transition oh man and, and sorry if i had a little delayed reaction but it took me a minute to catch up of what was happening <laughs> and your your need December, the leaves are brown on the ground. In Spain, I did love and adore you. The nights filled with joy were our yesterdays, and tomorrow will bring you near me. I can recall my desire, every reverie is on fire, and I get a picture of all my yesterdays. Yesterday, I can say, I get a look every time I see. Oh, that was smooth. The bright lights and songs were our joy today. And the nights were the heat of yearning. I can recall my desire. She's got the little hip going into it, too. I get a picture of all of yesterday. Yesterday, I can say, I can think of it's time to say your days. Oh, my goodness. I see moments of history. Even the horns sound good. Oh, that was a cha-cha transition. I, I dance cha-cha. I can recognize that in about a quarter second. Get a picture of all of yesterday's yesterday. I can say, I get a kick if it's time I see your gaze at me. Oh, yeah. Totally cha-cha. Oh, yeah, come on. I'm confused though, because I don't see, although they keep introducing more members of the band, um, you know, video with the cinematography, but uh, I don't see any other um, singers here. So I'm guessing they're off to the side. I don't think they would dub them over or mix that in. And I don't think it's an effect where they've got some kind of harmonic effect on her. I don't think. Um, we'll see anyway. This is a good band, too. 
This, I mean, they're tight. Every one of them sounds good. This is fantastic. Her Spanish sounds good. She takes a different, I mean, I don't know if it's intentional by that section, but you know, this often happens when we speak different languages, right? I sound different in Spanish than I do in English. My wife sounds completely different when she speaks Polish. So when she sings in Spanish here, she takes on a different tone. It's a very different timbre. Knew it. So they took on a key change there, which was oh my gosh, I love that arrangement. That was that was sick, right? I heard that key change and I I just instantly was like, okay, maybe they're transitioning, but it just happened. Um, that was sick. Right when you get into what you know is in the original version of this with Santana, the guitar solo, then they do the kind of uh, I wanted to just sway back and forth with the horns, and then they transition. Right, listen to this. <laughs> right here, I think. Yeah. Okay, I had to go back because I got another ad. Yeah. Oh, this is so good. And no one could seem to something. But you found the answer. You told me to take this chance and learn the ways of love, my baby, and all that it has to offer. In time Okay, so now we go into uh, Don't You Worry About a Thing, uh, which is another cha-cha feeling. So that's beautiful to, to tie those together with the mix. Um, look, she changed characters when she went into all this love. Completely. She started sounding very poppy. Her body language changed. She got a little sassy. 
Um, she's an actress as well, as an incredibly talented singer. Gotta hear that transition again. Okay, so I had to stop there because not only was that just an impressive 25 seconds or whatever, but the way that that peaked and climaxed in the entire medley is, is beyond impressive. And I'm going to talk more about that, but I will say that I reacted to Don't You Worry About a Thing from her where she's actually got her baby she grabs and sings to her and that was completely a cappella. And I was blown away by her ability to do those chromatic dissension passages as well as just her vocal prowess while she's just casually doing it. Now, obviously here she sounds better and the performance is even a better quality. Um, but I did expect this, this explosion from her because I saw that performance. But to hear it in context where it's built and it's built and it's built and there's all these transitions, we go up and down. And um, the way that this is all composed, I think the order, the sequencing of how this is done is brilliant. I think going back to that original feel from Oye Como Va into worry, Don't You Worry About a Thing as we finish this up. And now we build to this peak. And then that transition right afterwards. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh. still not seen the other vocalists they're there i'm assuming i assume they're live off of the side why have we not seen them are they going to show them at the end as they pan around or something i love that b2 
still shows there's almost two minutes left. Okay. So we got closing credits. Um, Katrina Velarde, you just rocked my world. That was like, okay, I've followed you some. I've reacted to some of your stuff. Some of it has been amazing. I've looked at it as, you know, top notch. But now I understand. Now I see. Now I, I get it. <laughs> Holy cow. That was an absolute masterclass. She took on 22 different characters throughout all that. And her timing is just ridiculous. Now I go back. So if you watched my reaction to... I think it was Don't You Worry About a Thing. Where I talked about her timing on that. Um, here it's evident that she, she has incredible timing. Because that entire song, start to finish, was tight across the board. Kudos to the band, really. Um... And that arrangement, I don't know if she arranged it. If she did, that is a whole nother discussion. Because this medley, the arrangement is, is, is world class. Like really, it is. Just all the subtle nuances, the transitions. I mean, that transition, I gotta hear that again. Back into Oye Como Va, if I can find it. Um, or from, from Oye Como Va to All This Love. Yeah, that's it. Right there. All right. Here we go. Oh, and right into it. I oh, 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 yeah, baby. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. Um, wow, this was incredible. Okay, this is a long one. But this this whole thing is 11 minutes. So um, anyway, if you haven't yet done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit the alarm bell so you get more notifications of reactions. Uh, thank you much, and we will catch you in the next one.